Hi all. Let's talk about lessons learned in SSIS projects. It is a very important interview question. So what are all the lessons you learned in your previous project? So first point. So as a part of the lessons learned, if you see the notifications are not enabled in the SSIS package. So why these notifications are required? So let us assume, so uh, there is a package got failed in a particular step. If the notifications are enabled in that package for a particular step, then I can easily identify so where exactly the error is. And I will be notified with a mail so that I can easily know. Otherwise, I have to physically go to a package execution and you have to see either package failed or success. So if I enable a notifications for all the stuff, either success or failure for each and every important task, then it is very easy for us to say either success or failure or where exactly it got failed. So as a part of the lessons learned, so we need to enable the notifications in the future SSIS projects. Second stuff, so no checkpoints are maintained. So there are some critical scenarios. So where you need to restart the package from the earlier failure. So let us assume it in the previous run. So package got failed in the 10th step. So whenever you run for the next time, you should not run one to 10 steps. You have to start from the 10th step only because of the data sensitivity. So that time in that scenario, checkpoints are really needed and you need to enable the checkpoints at that package level. Otherwise, so the data duplicate is going to be occur in the system. So again, it purely depends on the data sensitive side. Third point. So no logs are maintained for future analysis. For example, so the my package have five steps. So package got failed at the fourth step. So if the log is enabled in that particular package, I can easily open the particular pack uh, log file and I can easily say the package got failed in the fourth step with so and so error message. If the logs are not enabled, so I have to go to the package and I have to again run the package to see where exactly the error message is. So these are all the points very important whenever the project goes to the production. So if these points are not enabled or these points are not taken care. So in the production system or in the SSIS project. So it is it, going to be typical for us to maintain the production system. So while developing a project in the future, at least please be take care of this three points. First point is notifications are not enabled. Let's enable the notifications wherever it is required. Second point, no checkpoints are maintained. Please maintain the checkpoints based on the data sensitivity. Third point, so no logs are maintained for future analysis. Please maintain the logs wherever it is required. So that's it. So thank you for watching. If you like our videos, please like and subscribe and share. Thank you.